Willie D. Live. I think it's less than 40 people in the world out of all entertainers right now. I'm in that category that's got over 100 million views on YouTube. Yeah, 100 million views for Wanna Be a Baller. Yeah, I'm yeah. at 102 million views right now Yeah, on Wanna Be a Baller. 100, over 100 million views. 100 million. Yeah. We ain't say a million now. We said 100 million. Did you do anything special to celebrate? No, I hadn't. You did? No. I ain't you should do a hundred million views party. Yeah, I should. But uh, I, I me, mean, it's like I just take the excitement that it come from and just say thank God, I appreciate it. You know, what I'm saying you made you fulfill something that I tried to do and I accomplished that. Yeah. I, I you know I know a lot of people say I need to celebrate, take it out and do something with it, let people know for they can really know what what I've done. But when I go in my house and I see my kids, I see the plaques on the wall. I see my bank account, I, I be happy with it myself. And you know you know what? That's cool, but I feel like if you live to see it and somebody tells your story, that you're going to be pissed. No. You, you, I think you should tell your own story. I know, but it's on. You my, should tell your own story. My try. son, he on my ass. Everybody and, around and, my circle on, my, on, on, me, uh, on me about telling my own story. But you know who I told you I want to tell my story? I want my grandson, Troy the Third. I want him to tell the story of, of uh, collect all the footage, data, everything about me, and he do it from his standpoint of watching and knowing, learning about his ground his, his G pop. Well, you got to do it before somebody try to try to uh, do it without you know do it unauthorized. Mm. You know, because they can still do it. They don't need your permission to do a story about you. Yeah, they can do an unauthorized story, and, and many people would take that story as, as that's what it the is. Gospel. The gospel, yeah, yeah. Unless so, it come from me, then yeah, they'll so, say all that. Yeah, so mm. you know, like I don't think about that. Will it you you always give me some good advice every yeah. time. Every time I talk to you, you always tell me some real stuff. So I might have to think about that. Yeah, think about it, man. You know, like, I mean, who who better to tell the story than you? A lot of stuff is going to be left out. Like, if I had, just knowing what I know about you, I think I could tell a decent story. Yeah. But I just learned some new stuff right in the then. last 10 minutes or so just sitting here with you that I didn't know. Yeah. Now, that's in your head. That's what you know. That's Because mm -hmm. it's your story. Yeah. Nobody knows your story better than you do. And you can take those individuals that you just mentioned in, in the story, and they don't know the other players who were involved yeah. in your story. You see? Yeah. So you, you, you know what I'm saying? Man. Can nobody to... tell that story better than you can tell it? And, and Hey, 50, where you at? I got a story to tell. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, I think, but you know what? At the same time, you know, you 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 got a boss type mentality. So you know, I know if it, if you put your mind to it, yeah. I think you you mess around. With it. Yeah, man. Uh, well, uh, wanna be baller movie in, in theaters? Uh, on on Roku? Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? On Netflix? Yeah, yeah you, you'll make something happen. I man, let's talk about T two, man. Your son, you know, T two was like. Supposed to be next in charge. Yeah, you know, God you damn. had him set up real nice, man. man. You know, like right after you drop your stuff, and man, you know, you was, he was hot, Willie. You know, you had T two position real he was hot, good. He was hot to take it to the next level to take short top, stop records to the next level. He was hot, and he what happened? He went to jail, man. They went, he did a, I, I read a robbery, man. Called a case, man. And right at the midst, of, I'm negotiating with Universal, Sony, all the other record companies. I'm talking to them and stuff about T2. They calling me, asking me, you know, this stuff. Keeping, they got their eye on him. Mm -hmm. And when I went to Universal to get the deal with Universal, what they offered me, I say, hey, Monty, this ain't gonna get it right here, Monty. I put too much work in my son. He said, Troy, I know what you want. You go out to make it a little more harder. I write. I give you everything you want on your son. I know. I know what you want, cause they were just trying to get me to do management. I said, no, I'm getting points and everything. And you know, by me knowing how the point system worked, my son asked me, Dad, why we ain't signed with Universal? I said, Son, I'm gonna be honest with you. If I'd have signed you with Universal right now, and you'd have sold a million records, you'd be like, Where the money at? Cause the, the deal they were finna give you wouldn't have been no money. Mm -hmm. If you sold records, right. it'll look the good you own Universal, but by me knowing how this money work, I couldn't let you sign with them like that. So <laughs> and let you the... know how the money works. 